are now listening to Lower Road Radio. Hey, welcome one and all to the number one podcast, winter, spring, and fall. Talking sports for the thrill of it all. Hey, talking life, but we're killing it all. Jason and Dan with the master plan. These are dangerous men with the mic in the hand. Huh? Four to five winners everywhere that we go. You're a part of the team. Lower Road Radio. Dad life, thug life, bright lights in sight. All right, what? Dad life, thug life, bright lights in sight. All right, yeah. Dad life, thug life, bright lights in sight. All right, what? four to five winners everywhere that we go. You're a part of the team. Lower Road Radio. Let's get it. What? At Tanagra when the walls fell, this is Dan Owens coming at you another time for Lower Road Radio with my co-host, as always, Jason. But not just Jason today. We have multiple guests. We have multiple. Well, we have one guest. Oh, I'm, yeah, yeah. Um, it's a first time guest. And wait a minute. What first female ever on the podcast? What is that true? I think that is true. I mean, John Meadows was on. Yes. So, yeah, I mean, second. <laughs> First female ever on the podcast. Wow. Um, you should feel really special right now. Yeah. In response to our uh, heated uh, debates that we've had privately, uh, with the, I've had, I will introduce the guest in a second. Yes. Um, but uh, this uh, individual and I have had very heated debates about the discussion of sit ubu sit versus sit boo sit if you've listened in the past episodes um just to catch you up jason tell us the, the you'll be the moderator in the dis- discussion so tell us real quickly so there's a production company mm-hmm. that has uh produced multiple tv shows at the end of the tv show they end with a closing segment so like in the movies like the bad robot movies it goes bad robot right. and the robot goes across the screen Mm-hmm. Where there's one called Ubu Productions, where there's a black dog. It's a stationary screen, by the way. It's not mm-hmm. moving. Yeah. And the closing audio that you hear is this. I'll play. Is it. this play? It. Sit, Ubu, sit. Good dog. Do it one more time. There. Yeah, that, yeah, that happened quick. Sit, Ubu, sit. Good dog. One more time. Sit, Ubu, sit. Good dog. <laughs> All right. So there it is. Yes. And um, my wife and I had an argument. She said it was sit, ubu, sit. I said it was sit, boo, boo, sit. And my daughter got involved in the conversation. And we've had many heated discussions. And so I asked her to come on to... Your daughter or your wife? My daughter. Yeah, your wife couldn't be on the show. No, she would jump across the table and strangle you or me. <laughs> So I'm hoping Abby shows more restraint. This is Abby Owings, first female ever on Lower Road Radio. How you doing, Abby? Hi. <laughs> Are you excited? Mm, I'm nervous. You're nervous. I mean, there's literally thousands of people listening. Literally to you right now. thousands of people. Thousands? Are you sure? Don't, yes. What, are, why you, would you, are you sure? Listen, of course, this we're is sure. going to get okay. you a house on the beach. Don't knock it. Okay. Really? Yes. Do you sure? want to live on a house on the beach, Abby? No. Do you want to have an extra house on the beach that we can go to whenever we want on family vacations? I don't like hurricanes. <laughs> I'd rather she's have. She's already. I'd being, rather have. She's already being contrary. contrary. Yeah. We should get a house on the lake and own a boat. Abby, are you contrary? Maybe. Oh, that's a good answer. Very good answer. The answer is yes. So, do you want a house on the lake then? Yes. With, with yes. the boat. Okay, well, this is how this is going to happen. So don't knock it. Don't act like thousands of people, really? Yes, thousands, maybe even hundreds of thousands will listen to this, okay? That is true. By the time it's all said and done, it'll be hundreds. Of, initially, thousands. Yeah. When it's all said and done, hundreds of thousands. So, Abby is 11 years old. She is in the fifth grade at Pleasant Elementary, and she feels very passionately about this issue. So I think the right thing to do is to... Let her talk first. Now, I, I guess I'll say my end, and then you can respond. Is that okay? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. So I understand that when you look at the screen, it says UBU Productions. Yes. I also understand. Well, let's just set the, set the ground rules really mm-hmm. quick. Yeah. So here, here's how this is going to work. Dan, you're going to give your case. Yes. Okay. Okay? Mm-hmm. And then, Abby, you can give your case. Of each side of the argument. And what is the question of the debate? Specifically, right? It comes down yeah. to either ooboo or 
Boo Boo. Not what he meant to say. Not what the dog's name is. The question is, what does he say on the, the video? The audio itself. Yes, the audio itself. Okay. He, yes, Abby? It's his... The dog's name is spelled U-B-U. Yes, the dog's name is spelled U-B-U. For those of you that don't know, Ubu Productions is the name of the company, and the guy that ran the company was the guy that produced um, Family Ties and uh, Spin City and some other pretty popular... Uh, a lot of CBS stuff. CBS sitcoms. Yeah. And he had a dog named Ubu. All right. And so he called it Ubu Productions, and the picture apparently is his dog. That's his real dog. Yes. And it's called Ubu Productions, and it's his voice saying yeah. the words that the we're words, debating yeah. about. Yeah. So what do, what are you thinking, Abby? Well, you think that because I always agree with mom that you you think that I just went with mom's opinion right away, but yeah, you I do think that. So you guys were in the kitchen and listened to that, and then I came in, mm -hmm. and then you said, "What did you think? What What did you hear?" Yeah, and I heard Ubu. You like, heard Ubu like from Mom. the very first time before you even knew the dog's name was Ubu. Yeah, I heard Ubu. You I kind of heard Boo Boo. Okay, but yeah. So, um, so even when we play it in slow motion, you still hear, um. Mom's right about a lot of stuff. Okay, what does mom write about when it comes to this? She's <laughs> not about. He, Abby just so said she, a lot of stuff, and you said about this. About this, she said when she said when she was younger, she thought it was Ubu the first time she heard it. Okay, well here it is in uh, one quarter speed. <sighs> All right, there it is. And if, you, even after hearing that, you still feel like you hear Ubu instead of Boo Boo. If, if you listen closely, All it right. still kind of sounds like Ubu. No, oh, why? Wait, no, wait. Listen, it kind of sounds kind, like Ubu? You, or it does sound like Ubu? Mm, well, it mostly sounds like Boo Boo, but I think it, it really... Wait, say that one I more think, time. What, say it just one more time. No. <laughs> she just said it mostly sounds like Boo Boo. But or have I changed if your mind, you Abby? No. If you it's listen... It's okay to change your mind. If you, it's all right. If you want to change your mind, that's the mark of a mature person. If you listen closely, you can hear the ooh. I feel like when you, you speed it up, it, you hear it even better. Oh, shoot. What did I just do? Okay. That's because you're speeding it up. If you sped it up, I would say it said... Ooh. Okay, Yikes. so listen. Yikes. The question is... You said in slow motion, it mostly sounds like boo boo. Although you I know can why hear, you can think that. But you think it. So why do you think I hear boo boo? Um, because it sounds like it. I don't, I don't it, know. Because it sounds like it. It's, it sounds like, but, well, on the video it it said ooh boo, and yeah. that's what made me think. That's what made me. So think you feel ubu. like because you know the dog's name is Ubu. And because it says Ubu, and it's the guy saying it, that it has to be Ubu. Well, he might have messed up, but I'm pre it doesn't – I know his name is Ubu. Right. But if you, if you Wikipedia, if you, you search it up – Yep, and we encourage the listener to do that. If you search it up on Wikipedia, you can find – Mom did this. Yep, and she did. And Mom, and it says the – what's his name? B Boo boo, ubu. No, the person's name. Oh, I don't remember Ubu's his name. Boy. It doesn't matter. Yeah. That doesn't matter. But anyway, he. It says that he said, "Ooh, sit, ubu, sit." Okay. And that's that's all you need because it says because he said and and, and in fact, Abby, I'll help you up. even more. I listened to an interview where he said, "Sit, ubu, sit." In the interview, and yeah. when I heard it in the interview, he definitely said ubu. But what I'm saying is on the video that I keep playing. That he definitely says boo boo. Do you do you want to change your mind? Now that I think about it, we can agree to 
disagree. We can what? agree to disagree. Yes, listen. His, we like can agree. No. We can agree that his name is Ubu. Yes, and that I agree. and that's how you pronounce it, Ubu. Uh huh. That's the dog's name, and that's how you pronounce it. One hundred percent. And we can absolutely. and we can also agree yes. that they said Boo Boo. But you can but he okay. m- you can tell that he messed up because you can hear uh-huh. a little bit of Ubu. Okay. Okay. I think this is good. So yes. we're both giving a little bit, right? I'm admitting that his dog the dog's name is actually Ubu. Uh huh. And he maybe even meant to say Ubu, but it definitely sounds like Boo Boo, which means he must have messed up. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's good. I feel good about this. Yeah. And See, the listener yeah. should pay attention. This is how you have civilized debates. It's That's okay. Right. We agree to disagree. We both give up We're a little bit. We're both very competitive. We are both very competitive. You are the most competitive person <laughs> I know. You're... What? What? I... She, she's the most competitive person you know? She's pretty stinking competitive. Mm. I don't... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to debate about that? Uh, I don't know what to compare myself. Gideon's pretty competitive. That's that's who I was thinking about. <laughs> and you guys are the same age. You know, I think he might be a right little now. bit. Did you know this? Are you guys are... against each other? Or same team. Uh, against each other. My next game will be against him. And I, th- and I... <laughs> we need to get videotape of this. I would love to do this. Yeah. Well, if they're in the championship game, parents are invited to come watch. Yeah. So I'll definitely. Uh, we we won our definitely we won go our in video. we. We won our first game. So flag football for fifth grade at yeah. Pleasant is mm-hmm. a big deal. It's a big deal. They yeah. divide up all the teams. Mm-hmm. And, and they have a championship game. They invite all the parents. The band comes and plays yeah, at it. Yeah, it's a big, big Everybody deal. Everybody gets announced. There's yeah. like an announcer the whole time. So it's a big deal. All right. So here's what we're going to do. Uh, discussion over. I feel like we both won. Does that, does that feel good? Uh, yeah. It's a win-win. It's, it's, it's hard for me to let it go. But okay. All right, that's it, good. Yeah. What do you think Mom's going to think about this? Uh, she's still going to be mad, and I, <laughs> I feel like I want to be on her side, but I just can't. It's hard sometimes. Mm. Yeah, mm. it really is. Oh my gosh, she's listening to this. I know. <laughs> it's driving her crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here's what we're going to do, really quickly. We're just going to run through. This is going to be the dog episode. So we're going to do some dog Mount Rushmore's. The doggy special. Right. So, Abby, if you have anything while we're talking that you feel like we're missing, you just let us know, okay? Okay. So first of all, let's do dog accessories. You buy a dog. This is the Mount Rushmore of stuff. You adopt a dog. You don't buy a dog. Sometimes you buy a dog. Some people do. I Well, even when you adopt one, you have to pay for it. Like when That we, is true. We got Boomer. We had to pay, I don't know, whatever for the fees or the whatever it was. So um, Abby just almost knocked the mic over. But that's okay. Yeah, and then she, she gave the classic Dan look. Uh, <laughs> what I do. So um, you adopt, buy, purchase, yes. steal, find a dog, whatever yes. way you get the dog. What are the four things that steal? you – Steal? Yeah. Some people, I mean, some people do steal, some steal people, dogs. Yeah. yeah. It's not we don't encourage that. Mm-hmm. To, to, Cat burglars are very common. Dog burglars happen too. Yeah. Today in reading we were looking at like different genres of books mm-hmm. and one was one was about like the Nazis and everything and during, it was like realistic fiction mm-hmm. and they were trying to f- kill like everything German so they were trying to find all the German shepherds. Really? Yeah. Who was killing the German shepherds? The Americans? I think so, yeah. Oh, wow. That's messed. What a dark period because, in our history. Yeah. Because they thought... What did they ever do? Well, they were barking they wanted... in German. Heinz! Heinz! <laughs> Heinz! It does kind of sound... Yeah. yeah. German. All right, so what are the four things you got to have when you get your dog? Okay, so I think a classic is a food bowl. you gotta, you got to have, have a food are we bowl. Gonna, the food Collar. and water bowl, are those well, uh, same let's thing? let's just say bowl. Okay, bowl. Because it could double up as a food. You could just do the food. Once the food's gone, you fill it That's up with right. water. Okay, so bowl. A bowl. Okay, Abby? Collar. you got to have a collar. Collar, yeah. Right? Absolutely. So bowl, collar. Toys. Well, well, listen, listen. Toys listen. is a little vague. It is very vague. So we need something and a little bit more. We still have some other things that we can go with A little bit more here. specific. Leash. Like, leash is a big one. And if you plan to keep this dog inside, you need a crate. Mm. Well, we don't have a crate. We just well, keep at one point you did, right? <laughs> no. 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 Okay. A lot of people crate train their dog. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know that it's a got to have thing. I don't, I don't know, know that it's, if for an indoor dog it is outdoor it'd be a doghouse. Yeah, keep the dog outside of the elements. I mean, so can we Boomer say doghouse? Like dog house. And if that means inside or outside, yeah, that, I think that's good. Are you good with that, Abby? 
Yeah. Doghouse. So doghouse. Outdoors would be a traditional doghouse. Right. Indoors would be a crate. Because if the dog stays outside, you're gonna have he's gonna need something to escape right. the elements. I'd say I'd say if you have like a puppy, a chew toy, or like a, something to chew on. Well, that that might be our fourth thing. So we got a collar, bowl, doghouse, bone, something well, to chew I on. I think bones come and go. I yeah, mean, but bone is so like stereotypical dog. I mean, this is the Mount Rushmore. This is, I mean, it's bone. Are we doing any type of grooming supplies? Like a brush? We barely brush Boomer. Well, yeah. Boomer has short hair. Watson well, has long hair. Yeah, it's kind of mm. kind of longer hair. It's not short hair. Well, I feel like it would hard it would be kind of hard to We probably brush should Watson. brush Boomer. You should but brush. But he doesn't Boomer. get a lot of attention. <laughs> you should <laughs> You should probably get some grooming products for your dog. We yeah, do. But I still don't, I don't feel like it's above a bone. Yeah. A dog bone. You know what I mean? In the dog pound, the Cleveland Browns, what do they have? It's a bone. They got bones. Yeah. I mean, this is the Mount Rushmore. This isn't like... Like a squeaky toy. Yeah. See, that's Something a whole... to chew on. Yeah, like a rubber Something squeaky toy. Something to chew on. Do we feel like that's specific? You, What if you got a squeaky... What's the, what's Boomer's the, what's duck. the thing? I know when it's being carved on Mount Rushmore, I it's see a, bone. a bowl. It's, it's a, a bone. bone. It's a bone. Now, maybe it's a squeaky bone. Maybe it's a real bone. Maybe it's a rubber bone. You know... Boomer's duck. Boomer, Boomer has a duck. Yeah. He used to. What's well, a, it's a really squeaky Well, here's the sad story about Boomer. So we got him a duck when he was a puppy, and it was like his baby. He, he did, loved he, it. He would rip everything else up, but this thing he gently took everywhere he went and would just sit with it and sleep with it ever since he was a baby. One day I'm mowing the yard, and I accidentally mow over it. And oh. just, it turns into sh- shreds. Oh. And uh, then he, he walks over to it, and it's just like surveying the area. And just, I mean, <gasps> I don't think dogs can look sad, but this, he oh, definitely yeah. looks Absolutely, sad. Absolutely, yeah. And, uh, and ever since then, he's never, like, he rips up every toy that he gets. You know, like, we That's tried really to get him sad. the same thing, yeah. and he was like, no, I'm going to, you know, Why hurt you just you give him another can... duck? We tried, we tried, but he didn't want it. That oh. was his one we, duck. We have a duck now, but he doesn't really, and it's rubber, so it's hard to That one's break. different, yeah. yeah. But this thing, yeah, it's a sad story. All right, <laughs> so, bull, collar. House, bone, not a, not no no no. You said bone twice. Bowl. Oh yeah yeah. Bowl. Collar, house, bone. Are we doing any type of like on the collar? Is there also a name tag? I feel like that's included in the collar. That's included yeah. in the collar. Yeah. Did we say leash? Well, leash is leash did not make the list. Does wow. leash overtake bone or bowl? I mean, he can drink out of a puddle and he can put the food on the floor. You know, I don't know. Gosh, I don't Kelly's know. dog pushes the. Listen, pushes Kelly's the... dog. She takes her dog to Green Camp, uh, to the Green Camp Dairy Bar, and gets it its own ice cream cone that it <laughs> eats at the table. So that dog doesn't count. That's a fur baby. <laughs> that's not a dog. That's a fur baby. All right, leash or bone? Bone. I feel like bone. It's well, I feel emblematic. like you gotta have a leash if you train it really well. You know, we've that seen is true. people. There's like, some people in our neighborhood that walk through with their dog riding bikes, riding without. bikes even. Yeah, so okay, just we'll need a little bit more attention. All right, next dog breeds. Mm. The Mount. This is the Mount Rushmore this dog. I feel like Golden Retriever has to be on there. I kind of feel like you're right. I think that's a, a pretty one. epic one. Yeah. Um, I will make a case. I, I think Bulldog. Is a classic looking dog. It's a. It is a classic. Now it's not dog. my fan. I'm not a fan of a bulldog. Like pit bull, bulldog, you know, like English bulldog, English bulldog. The hmm. big droopy face. Yeah. I feel like we need a smaller dog on there. What's a small dog breed? Beagle. Yorkie. Oh, Beagle is pretty epic. Beagle's pretty epic. Yeah. I we have a Yorkie. I love my Yorkie, but uh, Chihuahua. Yeah. That's pretty classic. Yeah. It, it comes from a different area of the world, that was, so it makes oh, it a little Mexico. more international. That, that was yeah. like the only dog I knew a when I was younger, a chihuahua. So. It's a Taco Bell dog. Um, all right, so here's here's the... Here's Poodle? Just, I'm just going to throw some your way, okay? okay? Labrador Retriever. Well, a we lab. said Golden Retriever, right? So it was a Lab or a Golden Retriever? I don't know. I feel like Golden Retriever I think has Golden to be Retriever there. beats a Lab Retriever. Okay. German Shepherd. It's pretty classic. Yeah. Police dog. Yeah. I think I like Bulldog. I like Beagle actually a lot. I feel like we're missing uh, okay, so diversity. Let's, let's let's think about this. Poodle. Large, Poodle. medium. Well, I mean, I think that might be it. Large, medium, small, fancy dog. I feel like it's a Poodle. For the fancy? Yeah. 
So we got a golden retriever, a bulldog, a beagle, and a poodle. What about a greyhound, racing dog? I mean, there's a lot of things on this list that we can Siberian go with. husky? Yeah. We had a husky growing up. Huskies are cool. I like huskies. I mean, I like a lot. The, the I like they're very dog. compassionate. Dashhound, a corgi. I like the corgis. Maltese. Like, there's a lot of terriers that are good. But, I mean, we're looking at... Great Dane, the biggest dog there is. It's like a small yeah, horse. Great Dane is kind of a... It's iconic. It is iconic, because that's what we're looking for. Iconic. Not the best, the Remember most the iconic Tom dog Tom Hanks breeds. movie, him and Rottweiler? Turner and Hooch. Turner and Hooch, yeah. yeah Rottweiler. I, that's the first movie I ever cried at. <laughs> um... <laughs> And not the last. <laughs> no, not not the last time I cried at that movie. Every time I've seen it. <laughs> um, so what, what about what, like the mountain dog that carries the whiskey under its oh, chin? Oh yeah, that one's a cool one. It's like a mountain dog, Bernice Mountain Dog, or something, something like that. Something like uh, that. I don't know the name of that. Do you know that one, Abby? I think I, I is it an English Mastiff? Maybe I'm looking at one. Um, so what are the for sures? Do we do we definitely have a golden retriever on the list? I'd say. What about Basset Hound? This might be one of the harder ones we've ever done. There's a lot of really, really great dogs out there. Epic dogs. All right? That's where we need to be thinking. Epic. Epic. Okay. Epic. Okay. So are we trying to represent all dogs? The one from China that looks like a raccoon. Have you seen those dogs? I don't think they, so. These, What's uh, it they're called? actually and it looks a little Japanese island. I think it's – so you know in, in Mario Brothers when he turns into a raccoon? Yeah. Apparently he's turning into that dog. Really? And there's this dog, and there's they're only on this one island. Does this dog fly? Because the raccoon no, the, and Mario I flies. I don't understand why it flies, but it looks just like a raccoon. It's a dog that looks okay. like a raccoon. It's pretty cool. Trash but, panda. Un, yeah. Unfortunately, I mean, it won't make this list. No, it not, can't. It's not epic enough. Okay, so epic. Um, okay, so – God, I'm not even sure Golden Retriever makes it now. Really? I kind of think, like, definitely Bulldog, though. I, I feel think like Bulldog for Golden sure. Golden Retriever is, like, I feel no, like No, listen, it's, on it's a, a lot. good dog. We're not saying it's not a good dog. No, it's We're a great saying dog. Epic. Epic dog epic. is next level. I think Chihuahua has to make the list. I really do. It's a different breed, it looks different. All right. Okay. So we have Bulldog and we have Chihuahua. Okay. Um, I think we need some bigger dogs. I think Great Dane would be a great option. I like the Great Dane because yeah. it's very epic. It's huge. It's really big. When you is see the Great, a great Danes Dane, like the fl- big fluffy ones. No, like a Great Dane skin. is looks like a small horse. It's a big dog. Oh, but it has Google short search head? Great Dane, D A N E, and then you'll see what it looks like. Um, I like Great Dane, so yeah. we'll go Boxer, Chihuahua. No, not Boxer. I'm sorry, Bulldog, Bulldog, Chihuahua, Great Dane. Now we're, we need one more. Okay, so. German oh, Shepherd. Yeah. German maybe, Shepherd maybe, is a classic um, looking dog. Well, that leaves what's the that? What's off. what's that one? Um, what's that one on a hundred and one? D- oh, Dalmatian. A Dalmatian. A Dalmatian. Dalmatian. What's that? What's one? that dog on the hundred one Dalmatian? One hundred one Dalmatian. Oh wait, <laughs> Dalmatian. <laughs> what kind of dogs were those? One hundred and one Dalmatian. Yeah, she's right on that. Though that's pretty good. I think that has to be it. You think so? Yes. Wow. Because it looks so different than all the okay. other dogs. All right. It's an so, epic dog. It's different. Bulldog, Chihuahua. Great Dane, Dalmatian. Dalmatian. That's a pretty good list. All right. If we're carving yeah. that into a mountain, mm-hmm. that's going to come across pretty good. I think so. Although, how do you do the spots? You know what I mean? I don't know. Listen, we're not the artist. That's not for me. We to don't come. have that's to figure that out. Figure out. I don't have to figure that out. All right. Uh, we got two more real quick ones. Uh, the Mount Rushmore of dog names. Does Boo Boo belong on the list? Absolutely, one hundred percent. No, no, Ubu is not. No, I when I grow up, I'm going to name my well, dog. Well, I Ubu. believe you will. Do As it of now. right now, there's one dog ever named Ubu that we know of, and it's the guy that owns that production company. And my future dog. And your future dog. But there's a lot of Boo Boos out there. So we're talking about like Fido. We're talking about um, I don't know. Uh, Buddy. Rex. Buddy. Rex. A lot of dogs are named Buddy. I think. Max, I think Max is is a classic one. Duke, Duke. We had a Duke. Yeah, Duke is a pretty. I'm I'm looking at a most popular dog names list right now. So um, Max is on that list too, right? Yes. Um, bear. We also had a bear. So I've got a top ten male and female. We're, okay. We're not gonna. Well, you want to do two male, two female? Yeah, let's do it that way. All right. Well, who are we to judge this dog's gender? <laughs> Apparently, <laughs> nowadays. All right. Um. So I'll I'll go ten. 10 oh wait down wait to wait one. wait wait. What Rover? Rover's pretty good. I think Rover is 
a lock, right? I feel like Boo Boo's a lock. Okay, well, let's Although go through the list. list. Let's just name top. I don't know why. Here we go. Okay. Oliver. No. Tucker. Maybe. I know a Tucker dog. Bear. I think Bear is up there. Duke. Mm. Yes. Rocky. Yeah. Jack. We had a Jack. We, we had, had all Jack. these dogs. I know. Apparently, we're not very creative. Buddy. We yeah, didn't have a buddy. Uh, I, I, th- I didn't know you guys had. I didn't know you guys had any dogs. We did. Chopper. No. Charlie. Maybe. I know a Charlie dog. Max. See, I like Max. Max is pretty good. Yeah. But I like Boo Boo, and I like, what was the one we said earlier? Rover. Rover. Are we thinking about good. like the classic names or? Just iconic. Just, I don't know. I feel we're like, carving these into I a mountain, like, Abby. I feel like how, carving names. Yes. Yeah. It's we're not, carving names I feel like, into a mountain. I feel like Buddy because I know a lot of dogs named Buddy. Buddy's pretty good. And it's just something you just say. Well, does popular always mean epic? So Oliver Sometimes. might be a popular name, but I think Oliver is a horrible name for a dog. <laughs> well, it's not the best names. It's the most epic That's name. what I'm saying. Mm. It's not mm. popularity. Well, let's not come at this lightly. All right, here's the 10 female dogs on my list. You ready? Yeah. Number 10, Stella. Really? Yeah. Huh. <laughs> Maggie. Okay. Yeah. Bailey. Yeah. Molly. Sadie. Lola. Daisy. Luna, Lucy, Bella. I don't like any of those dog names. I think I feel like Daisy might da- be. Yeah, you're right. Daisy's pretty good actually. So let's okay, let's go one female and we'll three, go Daisy. three boys. All right. So Daisy's boys, yeah. the female. We've said that Rover and Boo Boo are locks. I think Rover and Boo Boo are locks. So we only have room for one more. Max, maybe. Max, Max is, is up there. Buddy. I like Buddy. buddy. You don't we, like Buddy. I don't care for Buddy as much. Bear and Duke are both pretty and good. And Jack. I feel like Duke is really good, though. Duke is really, yeah. really good. Yeah. Let's go Duke. Okay, so what is it? So we got Duke, Boo Boo, Rover, and Daisy. And Daisy. That's pretty good. That's your Mount Rushmore of dog names. I like it. That's pretty good. All right, last but not least, the Mount Rushmore of famous dogs. And now, this is fictional or real life? Are you talking life? about... Yeah, yeah, they could be real life dogs. I can't think of one that's a real life one. Well, like the, um, like their dog Balto. actor dogs. Balto. Like Benji. Yeah. Well, the, Air yeah. Bud. I mean, he was a character, Benji, but I mean, Benji was a real dog, right? Benji belongs in the discussion for sure. That's Air okay. Bud. Air Bud. Bud. Yes. Air Bud is Air definitely pretty on the famous. List. He's you got ready, you ready for this? Movies. Yeah. Clifford the Big Red Dog. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Snoopy? Toto. Mm. Who's Toto? Who's Toto? From the Wizard of Oz. The little... And you're a little dog, too! I've only seen that, like... What about Scooby-Doo? What about Rin Tin Tin? There's so many. That's pretty classic. The Lassie's for sure. Listen, this is going to be a hard list. This is going to be a lot more difficult than what you think. What about Beethoven? (laughs) Remember those movies? Yeah, I remember those movies. Balto. Yeah, I don't know yeah. what that is. What is that? What not it like a real life? While many thing? may be familiar with the 1995 children's film Balto, some may not realize that the cartoon is based on fact. In the middle of the 1920s, in the middle of the frigid winter, the quaint town of Nome, Alaska, had a fatal case of diphtheria on their hands. With no means of transportation available to them than dog sleds, Anchorage, Alaska, seemed very far, 500 miles away. But it was there that the community of Nome needed to be. In order to gain, I've already in, lost interest. All right. Well, apparently, really Balto is the one that movies. saved an entire like. Okay, city. so he got a bunch of like medicine. Like he's like a legitimately like hero, hero. dog. Like he saved like five. Yeah, I've lives. never heard of him. I think it's fine. What about hundred one <laughs> Dalmatians? Can like we put all up, of them? Yeah, we'll just put a hundred and one like puppies up there. I mean, I, <laughs> if we didn't have others that were so good, maybe. But I feel like no, it's not. I feel like up... Airbud is a lock. God. I don't know that Airbud is a lot. Listen, maybe I for your th- generation. I, I think for so. your generation, a maybe. lot of those that you were saying, Listen, I didn't really know. Benji, if I think about it, and Lassie ben, are locks. Who's Lassie? Who's Lassie? She wouldn't know Lassie. If, no, if you if you maybe say who she is, I might remember. It's the old black and white where Timmy gets stuck in a well and Lassie goes to get help. No. But, and you're just gonna have I, to trust us that Lassie okay. belongs in this list. I feel like what Benji was that? And Lassie. Benji, Benji. You've seen Benji. It's sad. Have Have you shown no, her? No, but we should. Oh, my gosh. So you tell the story. Listen. Listen. I'm listening. Listen. Do when you, we were how kids. How do you guys know what you're talking about? Just oh, we, listen. Listen. Come on. We know. We know. 
when we were kids, we had Benji the Hunted on VHS. Great movie. I think we probably filmed it off a of TV. Mm-hmm. Uh, Disney Sunday Night Movie. Benji movie. was being hunted. Benji was being hunted by this wolf. Hence the term. Which oh. actually was like a German shepherd. Eh, that's fine. But listen, they called it a wolf. Mm-hmm. And this wolf is chasing Benji up this cliff of mm-hmm. this mountainside. Benji dives into the bushes, and this wolf slash German shepherd goes flying over the cliff. And it fell 300 feet oh. to its death. Oh. Right here, can I go? But we would turn the TV up All really, really way. loud. As, as loud as it could get. As loud as you can get it. And you could hear a if you, splat. If you put your ear right next to the to the speaker, no, it's hear. it's louder than that. Because since then, I've pl- it's on Netflix. Mm-hmm. I played this for my kids, and it does splat. Still, my, yes, it splats, and my kids laugh oh. so hard. So that movie's so on I, Netflix. Yeah, it's online. Netflix, right. Amazon. I'm gonna something have like to that. look it up. And it is phenomenal. We used to do that over and over again, over and over and over, Ooh. and we would laugh every time. We would <laughs> rewind the video. Yeah, tape. do you know what rewind means? Yeah. Be kind. <laughs> they still rewind. call it rewind, but that is true. But you're not what are you winding rewinding anything. anything yeah, now. you're just winding. Going back. Yeah, because the, there used to be a physical tape, like the thing would wind, so you'd have to. It would go forward, but you'd have to rewind. Oh, you know what? The other back. day, I <laughs> I borrowed a U-Haul truck. Or I rented a U-Haul truck to take to move a piano. Yeah. And we get in the car, and it had manual windows. The first time I've been in a car with manual windows in forever. Wait, yeah. um. So, what was that Lu- Luigi? Did we name him Luigi? The car. Oh, yeah, that had, yeah, we had a car that, that had, had yeah. Okay, so um, I'm with Harrison. He's with me. Mm-hmm. And I said, hey, it's hot in here. Let's roll down the windows. Wow. And, he's, and he couldn't, fit, like, wow. what, what am I doing? Wow. <laughs> You're literally rolling yeah. down the window. Yeah, right. Yeah. Or but, rolling but up now the window. It's, they would now never, it's just a They button. wouldn't say rolling now. Well, like, well, that's what we say. You would, hey, yeah, roll but up the windows. Yeah, if you just came up, like, if, do, if they, if. The first car that was ever invented had a button. You wouldn't call it rolling. You would call it like pushing. elevate the window. You'd say push the window down. Deflate the Press window. Press the window down. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Very similar. So I think Lassie and Benji and Toto. Rin Tin Tin. And Rin Tin Tin. I think that's the list. Who's Rin Tin Tin? You oh, have a you lot know, of education, uh, uh, educating you, to do. What, what, what's, the, what's the one I'm forgetting? Scooby-Doo. Oh, shoot. Scooby-Doo? Yeah. We weren't allowed Goofy. to watch that. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Oh. Gorsh! Oh my gorsh is what you meant to say. Gorsh! Oh my gosh! What What's is the, the dog? Jetsons dog? Astro! Astro! What's the dog that dies? The famous movie where the dog dies. It's like the saddest movie oh, of yeah. all time. What was that? Um. Um. What's that? How? Old Yeller. Old Yeller. Old Yeller. Yeah. All right, Lassie, definitely. Yes. Maybe we get rid of Toto and Benji. Okay. I feel like Old Yeller. Is old, on the list. Okay, Old Yeller and Lassie, Lassie, and then Goofy, Scooby Doo. I think Scooby Doo for sure. I don't. Scooby Doo is on the list. Scooby Doo. I... You didn't allow us to watch that. Yeah, we didn't. No. Hmm. This was pretty mild. I don't know. You could probably watch it now. I'd let you watch it now. I you don't go home and watch it. No. Yeah. No, yeah. it's pretty great. I the, still the watch old it. ones are good. Yeah, the I... one with the Harlem Globetrotters. Classic. When we were kids, they came out with a new one, and it had Scrappy Doo on it. Oh yeah. We weren't allowed to watch the scary air, air bud. Okay, so what about Clifford the Big Red Dog? Mm. Yeah. Blues Clues. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> Man, there is. This was a harder list than I had anticipated. I just, I definitely want, I definitely want, um, what's the Scooby Doo, Lassie, and Old Yeller on this list? What about Cujo? Yeah, I like Cujo. Huckleberry Hound? Huckleberry Hound, that's pretty <laughs> do good. Do you remember Huckleberry Hound? Do I remember Huckleberry Hound? That's ridiculous. Of course I do. Ah, oh, man. There's so many good dogs on this list. This is a really difficult list. Lassie's for sure. I feel like Scooby Doo's for sure, and I feel like Old Yeller is for sure. So I feel like we need one Snoopy? more. Snoopy, Snoopy, it's Snoopy. Yeah. How do we forget? It's Snoopy. I we have two cartoons and two real dogs. Okay, so what's the definitive list? Lassie, Old Yeller, Snoopy, and Scooby Doo. That's it. So Lassie is George Washington. 
Yeah. I feel like... Snoopy. Old Yeller is Lincoln. Lincoln is Old Yeller, oh, for sure. There's no <laughs> doubt about that. <laughs> um, I think Snoopy is is Teddy Roosevelt. Because they were both shot. That's why we were saying that, right? <laughs> yes. Too soon? Too soon. On which one? Yes. <laughs> Old Yeller is Lincoln. Yeah, absolutely. Washington is Lassie. Yeah. Scooby-Doo is Jefferson. Uh, yes. Right? Yeah. And Snoopy is, is is Roosevelt. Roosevelt. Yeah, that's it. Okay. All right. I feel good about that's that. That's a show. <laughs> Longer than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> but you know what? When you got to talk about dogs, you got to talk about dogs. And that's just the way it is. All right, Abby. M- Mount Rushmore, really quick. What? Okay. Dog tricks. Tricks? Shake hands, sit. lay down, sit, roll over. Boomer doesn't know how to do any of that. He can sit. Fetch. He can sit. He, he can, can sit he can and like. Down. Boomer doesn't fetch. Wait a minute. Well, Boomer lays down. Sit. <clears throat> roll over. Yeah. How do you do fetch. fetch? And shake. You get the dog paw. Sit. Roll over. Fetch. Shake. Yeah. More than more than lay down. Well, I think sit and lay down could go together. Okay. Like you tell your dog Boomer, hey, go lay down. Yeah, and he goes to his blanket. Yeah. Blanket. So lay down, sit down. I think it's the same thing. Okay. So down. Or stay. Stay. It's stay. Stay's a big one. So I feel like, because stay and sit are different. He can stand and stay. He doesn't have to sit. <laughs> when I tell Boomer to stay, he sits down. Yeah. Well, because, you know, he's yeah. smart. Because he's tired. Um, Fetch, roll over, stay, and down. Sit or lay. Yeah. That's it. Wow. Speak? Oh, yeah, right? What are we missing? I think speak is one, right? Because you want him to... You want the dog to speak. On command. On command. Not whenever he wants to. No. Unless your dog is Scooby-Doo. And well, then... unless you can use... Or Astro. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I feel like... How did? How is that like so obviously the way a dog talks? Because Scooby Doo's kind of the same way, yeah. and we just take it for granted. Yeah, yeah. Of course, that's if a dog could talk. Of course, it would sound just like that. Ruh-ro. What's? I mean, I just want to throw another one out there for the famous dog on Spaceballs. What was the name of John Candy? He was a dog. Oh yeah, remember? Um, <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't Chewy. It was like no, it might have been Chewy. Was it Chewy? It been I don't chewy. think they used the names from the thing. I think it was like well, Chewbacca. Is yeah. The guy. Yeah, I think it could have been Chewy. Should we put him on the list? Pizza the Hut. <laughs> <laughs> we just need to be done. Yes. All right. I, I've got all sorts of things running through my I brain. Mean, lots I'm, of dog stuff going on yeah, right now. Dog, like treats, dog. There's all sorts of things. But for another another show, for another time. All right. I mean, famous phrases with dogs like dog days of summer, you know, oh, yeah. like things like that. There's a lot more to explore. Dog eat dog. Here. Dog eat the man. Come on, there's two already. All right, those are locks. We're gonna we're gonna call it right there. Please write into the show if you have any uh, dog suggestions or arguments with anything that we say, oh, yeah, yeah. or let us know. Maybe you hear something else. Maybe you hear poo poo. You know, so maybe we're both said, wrong. Yeah. I don't know. All right, well, this is Dan signing off for Jason and Abby. We'll see ya. Remind you to always <laughs> keep your stick on the ice <laughs> and never wear the blue sweats. Sit, poo poo, sit. Good dog. Sure. <laughs>